just be there so Feels pretty good. Love this thing. CMMG. Go get you one. You like touching dongs, don't you? I like touching dongs. <laughs> Yeah, baby. We are bound together now and forever. And I will never let you go. Baby, I can't wait to know. What do you think about this? Believe it. I will always be there. So you can tell me anything and I'll listen. I might even know what to say. guys as you can see we've had a lot of fun with the CMMG conversion kit and let me show you how simple it is to put it in your rifle at home all you do is you take out your bolt carrier group slide in the conversion kit bolt carrier into your gun let me actually take it off the magazine put your takedown pin back in and it comes with their own proprietary 25 round magazines so these things have worked very well for us and I would say now we are at a round count of about probably 2,500 to 3,000 rounds, if not more, that we've actually put through this thing in the last couple of weeks. Really fun setup, guys. This is a great way to still get a lot of training in at home while also still getting those reps in. Uh, 22 is now about the cost of what 9 mil ammo was in March of last year. So you have a huge increase on the wallet hurt when it comes to the funds you have to spend to keep up the training. Well, a lot of people are transitioning to 22, so this CMMG kit is exactly what you guys need at the range to still get in those reps and get that training in while trying to do all this during the pandemic that we're suffering through right now. We all know how bad ammo is. We talked about it in our videos in the past, and it doesn't look like it's going to get any better anytime soon. The great thing about this kit is it'll go into any 223 556 rifle and work with any of those setups. And it's as simple as taking out your current bolt carrier group, sliding the conversion kit bolt carrier in, and then using their 25 round magazine and you're good to go. So originally when we got this kit, all we had was a 556 can, and that's what we used with our seven and a half inch barrel setup here. Um, and then once we got our 22 cans, it has kind of been our dedicated 22 kit at the range. So one really cool feature about this self-contained conversion kit as well is that you can still use it with your folders and stuff freely. So like on this folder in particular, it's a Sylvan Arms folder. Normally it comes with a plunger that would attach into the back of your normal bolt carrier group. But since the self-contained bolt carrier group of the 22 conversion kit is in here, you actually don't have to use the plunger at all. 
So it is a solid back, so it's not going to work with this thing, but you don't need it because everything is spring-loaded inside this kit itself. So one very cool key, uh, feature about this and makes it even cooler at the range. This thing is so much fun. I can't tell you how many people get their hands on it and just love everything about it. There's no recoil at all, especially suppressed. It is very quiet. It is hearing safe practically without having a suppressor on it and it can go into any of your rifles so you can still try to shoot with any of those guns that you have in your arsenal and not break the bank too bad uh you know 18 cents around is still really bad for 22 but it is about the cheapest you're going to get at the range these days right now even trying to reload all that stuff it is just not happening with the current ammo crisis that we're suffering from but what else can I say guys? I recommend this to anyone that is willing to put in a little extra money um, into a product so that they can still get those reps uh, and pay off in the end. You know, I think this kit right now is about 225 bucks. You may be able to find it a little bit cheaper with some deals. I think a buddy of mine said locally he found one with one magazine and it was like 170, $180. So you can find them out there a little bit cheaper. We got the kit with three magazines. Um, CMMG did send this kit to us to do this video with. So we're very appreciative of that because it has quickly become one of the most favorite things I have uh, in my man cave, in my gun arsenal right now. So it goes to the range every single time we go and it is constantly just put through some more torture and holds up. I have not put any oil, any grease on this thing since I got it out of the package and well over a couple thousand rounds and this thing is still running strong it does not like to work with subsonic ammo so there's just not enough pressure to cycle that contained bolt carrier group and it does not like to um cycle that ammo and then you know function properly all right first mag through the seven and a half inch 22 kit with the 22 can we got a supersonic round first, just a normal Remington uh, 1400 round bucket, so I think they're golden bullets. We then have the CCI uh, Quiet 22 rounds. We then have the CCI Segmented Hollow Point Subsonics. And then we have a different brand Subsonic HP. Um, let's see which ones are qu uh, quietest with this setup here. So, supersonic first. And it cycled too. Now we should have a little bit of some cycling issues. <laughs> okay, so stove pipe. Did that go out? Yes, it did. That one's moving a little quicker. I think that's the one we've heard ricochet each time. All right, this one should be the real quiet one. <laughs> All right. So I did have a mixed pouch of 22. There was a few, I think, of the CCI segmented hollow point uh, subsonic rounds, a little moving a little bit quicker. They're moving a little bit over a thousand feet per second. They did actually cycle um, the gun, but it is not reliable enough that I would mess with anything other than just supers, you know, when you're messing with this kit. And they do say that on the package. I was not smart enough to read that on the package when I first went out. We were doing some night vision stuff with some suppressors, suppressors, so I took only subsonic ammo out. And while it was extremely quiet and extremely awesome, it was basically a bolt action gun and I quickly learned my lesson. So guys, if you like this video, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and let us know what you think in the comments below. We really appreciate your feedback and it gives us ideas on what we can do better in the future. Also, go look at CMMG. I promise you're not going to be disappointed with this conversion kit. It is well worth your money invested, and it is well worth the reps that you can get at the range for pre-COVID pricing compared to what we're dealing with these days. So thank you all for tuning in. I love you all. Stay alert. Stay alive. Catch you all next time. Boom.
Got it. Dude, that's nasty. 